Good evening. Happy end of Saturday. It has been National Best Friends Day. So I hope you got to celebrate with a good friend. Um, I did an event today and while the event did not go as well numbers wise as what I would typically hope for, I got to spend the day with a friend and uh, my daughter got to spend the day with um, my friend's child who's also her friend. So um, you know, it it made for a fun day for us, just in terms of socializing and um, sharing, you know, the day together. So I want to start with a really fun quote that I'm sure you've all seen, because um, it's, it's been made into a meme. It says, friendship is so weird. You just pick a human you've met and you're like, yep, I like this one. And then you do stuff with them. And that clearly explains pretty much how I've developed all of my friendships with all of my closest friends. Um, I guess one of the more recent examples in my life is whenever we moved to Plainview and um, we met the preacher and his wife. Uh, the preacher is retired Air Force and so um, we just immediately connected with them because of the military um, background and the wives of course understand that you have to claim your friend and you hold on to them because you don't know how long you have them. So it's here's my life story in five minutes or less and um, you know we're gonna do stuff now. And so that's very clearly, um, it, I, I love that quote, it relates very well to me. But um, I also really enjoy the Muppets. And so one of the posts that I saw had a picture of Kermit and Fozzie on it um, for the best friends. Um, happy best friends day meme and so I would actually written a blog post about lessons I've learned from the Muppets and I'm gonna share a few of those with you today that um, I think kind of apply to the day and I hope you get as much of these out of these as I have um, and the Muppets were just I don't know they're kind of like they were my friends when I was growing up I adored um, Jim Henson and his creative creation. So um, one of my first lessons that I learned is leaving the familiar might be scary, but the adventure and the friends that you make in your journey create a full life. Um, if you know anything about the Muppet movie, the first one that was back in, I think 1979 is when it came out. Um, the friends that you, uh, Kermit left the swamp. Uh, because he had a dream to make millions of people happy and uh, he left everything that he knew everything he was familiar with and went across the country um, the second lesson is most people that we meet are good people um, when you meet opposition getting through the obstacles is easier if you've built a support network of friends uh, number three these friends may come in all shapes colors sizes and levels of weirdo um, true friends will help you outrun the bad guy, provide you with a clever disguise, catch you when you fall, make you laugh and sing, and stand up with you when you face the enemy. Every once in a, every once in a while, your life may be blessed with old friends that you just met. Um, and that's from a song that's within the Muppet movie, if you don't know that. Um, Gonzo sings, there's not a word yet for old friends who just met. Um, Kermit became the leader of a group of friends that he never expected. Everyone looked to him for answers and guidance. You never know when you might become the leader of your group or who is learning from your example. So just because you don't necessarily think that you're making an impact, it doesn't mean you aren't. And just because somebody isn't in like your immediate circle, it doesn't mean that you're not touching their life in some way. Um, one of my favorite parts is the road trip that they take across the country and they end up, you know, all over the place. Saskatchewan, it's snowing and they're trying to get to Hollywood. And so this, the route they take doesn't really make a lot of sense. And, um, in the song moving right along they say getting there is half the fun and I think that is true anytime you are doing anything with a friend it can be a road trip or it can just be 
life. Getting there is half the fun. And uh, so when you set goals for yourself, you've made a promise. Falling short and breaking that promise hurts you more than it hurts those around you. This one is one I really needed to reread for myself today. It's something I came up with, but it's something that I needed to reread today. Because after, you know, having a day that wasn't a successful event, I need a reminder that, you know, my goals that I've set are a promise I've made to myself. And just because one thing didn't go well today doesn't mean all the other things that I have going on won't go well. Um, when you share your dream and with others, you work towards the same goal. This connects you. And the more people you share your dream with, the more you're, you succeed. Kermit and his friends found joy in working toward a goal, but they also became a kind of family. And that's also a quote from that movie. Now, the way the movie ends is um, they've made their movie and they're singing a song and the the last song says, Life's like a movie, write your own ending. So no one can tell you how your story is going to go. You get to decide. Each day is a brand new blank page and you get to start fresh. Each day you get to rewrite the script, add a new plot twist, write out bad characters, add some good ones, and you get to decide um, what your ending can be. So make your story a good one. Find good friends that are going to help you get there. If you'd like some more fun quotes on friendship, shoot me a message. I'd be happy to share them with you. Or if you've got um, other lessons that you've learned from the Muppets, I'd sure love to hear them. Uh, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Bye.